Precious metals are elemental metals that have high economic value. In some cases, the metals have been used as currency. In other cases, the metal is precious because it is valued for other uses and is rare. The most widely known precious metals are corrosion resistant and used in jewelry, currency, and investments. Gold, the most well-known precious metal in the world. Gold is the easiest precious metal to recognize because of its unique yellow color. Gold is popular because of its color, malleability, and conductivity. Gold remains a popular investment option as it hedges against inflation. Highly conductive, it resists corrosion. Many electronic devices use gold in different components. Some dentists use gold in their tools. Different metals mix with gold to make it stronger. This changes the purity of the gold. Naturally, the purer the gold, the more valuable it is. The carat of gold describes its purity. 24 carat, 99.9% .9 gold, the purest form, and so on. One ounce of gold values at $2,526.82 according to silverprice.org. Uses jewelry, electronics, radiation shielding, thermal insulation. It comes from mines primarily in China, Australia, the United States, and South Africa. Silver. Silver has been a precious, valued metal since ancient times. Pure silver has a white hue. A softer metal, it was once considered more valuable than gold. Silver is a popular precious metal for jewelry. It has utility in decoration, eating utensils, and electronics, but its value extends well beyond all of this. It has the highest electrical and thermal conductivity of all the elements and has the lowest contact resistance. Like gold, silver must combine with another alloy to become stronger. Copper is a common choice. One ounce of silver values at $28.83, according to silverprice.org, uses jewelry, coins, batteries, electronics, dentistry, antimicrobial agents, photography. Major sources are Peru, Mexico, Chile, China. Platinum. Platinum is a dense, malleable metal with exceptional corrosion resistance. It is nearly 15 times rarer than gold and finds uses in a wide range of areas. This combination of rarity and functionality might make platinum the most precious metal. The dense metal can be easily formed and manipulated, yet it retains its durability. It resists wear and tear, which makes it an essential component to industrial manufacturing. It mixes well with other metal alloys. Being scratch resistant also adds to platinum's value and utility. Uses catalysts, jewelry, weaponry, dentistry. Major sources are South Africa, Canada, Russia. Palladium. Palladium is similar to platinum in its properties. Like platinum, this element can absorb an enormous quantity of hydrogen. It is a rare malleable metal, able to maintain stability at high temperatures. This feature makes it valuable to car manufacturers. Putting it in cars helps their emissions go down. One ounce of palladium values at $1,083.90, according to AppMex, uses white gold jewelry, catalytic converters in automobiles, electrode plating and electronics, major sources, Russia, Canada, United States, South Africa. Ruthenium. Ruthenium is one of the platinum group metals, or PGMs. All metals of this element family are considered precious metals because they are typically found together in nature and share similar properties. It can also make palladium stronger when added as an alloy. The electronics industry uses ruthenium in plating electric contacts. The alloy's hardiness makes it a popular choice for combining essential parts together. It resists wear far better than many metals. It is another rare metal and can rarely be found in the earth, especially combined with other elements. Ruthenium values at $265 per troy ounce, according to Infomine, uses increasing hardness in alloys and coating electrical contacts to improve durability and corrosion resistance. Major sources, Russia, North America, South America. Rhodium. This highly reflective metal is extremely valuable due to its rarity in the world. It tolerates corrosive objects without warping or changing. Rhodium also has a high melting point, meaning it takes a long time for it to reach a boiling point where the metal becomes liquid. Uses reflectivity, including jewelry, mirrors, and other reflectors, and automotive uses. Russia, South Africa, and Canada are the largest producers in the world. Iridium. 
A white-like metal, iridium is a byproduct of nickel mining. It is processed from the platinum ore. Although it is part of the platinum family, it is on the extreme end. This is because it has an extremely high melting point and considered dense. In fact, it is the second densest metal on Earth. Iridium is extremely brittle, yet considered the most corrosion-resistant metal. The metal comes from meteorites that exist in the Earth's crust. InfoMine puts iridium's price at $1,460 per troy ounce, uses, pen nibs, watches, jewelry, compasses, electronics, medicine, automotive industry, major source, South Africa. Osmium. Osmium is arguably tied with iridium as the element with the highest density. This bluish metal is extremely hard and brittle with a high melting point. While it's too heavy and brittle to use in jewelry and gives off an unpleasant odor, this precious metal is a desirable addition when making alloys. Osmium sells for around $1,000 per troy ounce. Uses pen nibs, electrical contacts, hardening platinum alloys. Major sources, Russia, North America, South America. Other precious metals. Other elements are sometimes considered to be precious metals. Rhenium is commonly included on the list. Some sources consider indium to be a precious metal. Alloys made using precious metals are themselves precious. A good example is electrum, a naturally occurring alloy of silver and gold. Copper. Copper sometimes is listed as a precious metal because it is used in currency and jewelry. But copper is plentiful and readily oxidizes in moist air, so it is not particularly common to see it considered precious.